What is forward guidance? Forward guidance, in essence, is the ability and responsibility of the central bank to message to markets and investors what their plan for all their monetary policy tools is going to be. Most usually, it's about where they think interest rates are going to go or how long their quantitative easing programs are going to last. Forward guidance is actually something that's not very new, but it's been a, in higher prominence since the financial crisis, and certainly something that, because of media and press conferences these days versus many decades ago, is more important and moves markets a lot more. Let me give you an example of a sentence that the Federal Reserve said in December 2008, in the throes of the financial crisis, when all eyes were on central banks and what they were going to do to help get the global economy out of that rut. The Fed says, the Federal Reserve will employ all available tools to promote the resumption of sustainable economic growth and to preserve price stability. In particular, the committee, the Federal Reserve's committee, anticipates that weak economic conditions are likely to warrant exceptionally low levels of the federal funds rate for some time. This is a classic example of forward guidance, where they're telling market participants that because of the economic data that they're tracking, they expect interest rates to remain low for quite some time. It allows markets to perhaps breathe a sigh of relief because they know that the Fed won't be surprising them in the near term, and plan their economic and investment allocations based on the fact that that forward guidance indicates interest rates will be low for some time. This has been particularly important for the Bank of England here in this time when there is still some Brexit uncertainty in that they have very much made clear that they will await further decisions and negotiations by the UK and the EU before making drastic moves in bank rate here in the UK. Forward guidance is very important because whether it's the press conference uh, notes, the transcripts of Federal Reserve, MPC, uh, Bank of England committee members, or anyone in central banking around the world, we always try and get as many hints or as many outright statements from these central banks in order to think about how to allocate in the investment environment.